Hi, Melanie here with another Grassroots Minute for Bernie Sanders. Bernie Sanders voted against the Iraq War and believes that while military force is sometimes needed, it should always be the last resort. Bernie's commitment to stopping unnecessary bloodshed is matched by his commitment to taking care of over 20 million military veterans and their families. He served as chairman of the Senate Veterans Affairs Committee and received the 2015 Congressional Award from the Veterans of Foreign Wars, who said, quote, It's no understatement to say that Bernie has truly taken care of wounded, ill, and injured veterans and their surviving family members, end quote. He says the role of the United States military, uh, given its staggering human and monetary costs, war should definitely definitely be a last resort. Exhaust all other options first, but keep a robust military at the ready. About supporting military members and families, he said, American uh, military personnel and families, they face unique challenges. He wants to expand programs that support these Americans. Now about supporting veterans, he said, if you're going to send American troops to war, you absolutely must take care of them when they return. Fix the VA healthcare system and expand educational benefits. Now, Bernie has a long history of passionate advocacy for and effective deal-making on behalf of veterans across the country. He's chaired the Senate Veterans Affairs Committee, brokered significant legislative compromises, and championed the causes of ending veteran homelessness. Now, reducing the VA claims backlog and expending access to the VA system. Bernie has shown himself to be a close ally of veterans and he is someone who understands these Americans' unique needs and challenges. Now, on February 27, 2014, Bernie introduced veteran-focused legislation into a contentious Congress that was deeply concerned about spending. As he introduced that legislation, Bernie stated something that should have been so obvious to these reluctant uh, senators that weren't thinking of spending money on veterans. Quote, he said, it's about what our priorities are, and in my view, at the top of our priority list has got to be to protect and defend those people who have protected and defended us. Those people who have given much, much more than we can ever repay." End quote. Love that. So Bernie served as the chairman of the Senate Veteran Affairs Committee. Um, it was for two years, in 2013 to 2015. Now only in two years. What did he accomplish? So. Bernie was able to pass some of the most impactful and far-reaching legislation since post 9-11 GI Bill. Congressional Quarterly uh, applauded his work as chairman and described him as an effective deal-maker in a difficult negotiating environment. CQ hailed Bernie's ability to, quote, bridge Washington's toxic partisan divide and cut one of the most significant deals in years, end quote. Bernie's successful negotiation led to the passage of the Veterans Access, Choice, and Accountability Act, known as Choice Act. Google that. This helps veterans get access to health care through the VA. So change will not happen if we're passive, and we grassroots supporters for Bernie need your help. So help us help Bernie so we can help ourselves. Be part of the revolution and learn more today at berniesanders.com.